The explosion uh, was detonated underneath me. My legs had to be amputated. Josh Blyle lost his legs in 2006 to a roadside bomb in Iraq that killed two fellow Marines. We met Josh at Walter Reed as he tried out a new pair of prosthetic legs called the plie. He makes it look easy, but propelling the legs with his hips is exhausting. His balance and the mechanical adjustments must be just right. <laughs> right. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm good. A wheelchair would be easier, <laughs> but Josh That's is determined to walk. Back home in Indiana, Josh has six sets of legs, each designed for something specific, like climbing or water skiing. Yes. What is this? Uh, these are the latest and greatest. Uh, these are the power knees. They actually have a motor inside them. They help propel me. Josh is the first person to walk on two of these. Power knees are noisy, but the motors take the exhaustion out of walking. On power knees, he can cover a mile. What does this feel like? At first, it felt like walking on almost like electronic stilts, if that makes any sense. Uh, it does make sense. <laughs> How fast will these go? Faster than I can control, to be honest with you. <laughs> Not to a run yet, uh, but they do have a lot of power. 